Hi, everybody. Joe McDonald here. Welcome back to WWST, All Sports Radio for New York. And, of course, this Mayron Hughes story has become unbelievable. Did this kid who had the world in front of him, millions of dollars on the line, actually kill his agent? Of course he did. He has a history of being a troubled kid. He had a gun. It was his. The ballistics checkout. Who else killed him? Mayron Hughes killed him. That's who. Let's go to the phones right now. Out to Dan in Flushing. You are on WWST. What do you think? While the town was talking about pick number one, I wanted to talk to pick number two, Elvin Grace. Ever tried badminton? I should. You're Elvin Grace. I'll be right back. What do you want? Just want to talk to you. Mayron Hughes, you and he were pretty tight, right? I guess. How long did you guys play together? Oh, we go way back. Started out in Pee Wee's, YMCA teams. Eddie Thomas was our coach. Eddie Thomas? Got us straight through high school. Uh -huh. Even got us in St. Sebastian. Is that right? Yeah. Sit down. Let's sit down. Um, let's talk about Mayron. Um, did he have any enemies that you know of? Mm -hmm. Nah, just the other team. Ever hang around anybody that he shouldn't? Like you? Hey, hey. If I were a ref, that would be a technical. Look, Alvin, I'm just trying to clear your pal. What about bookies, Alvin? I don't know. We, we, we meet a lot of people. I mean, I don't ask for IDs. Say, Mayron doesn't make the NBA draft. The value of your stock would uh, jump a notch, right? I'm not worried about my stock. I got a trial tomorrow with the New York Knicks. Mayron can take care of himself. Who's going to take care of you? Listen, if you don't help us, your buddy Mayron's dead meat. Give us something. Point shaving angle, a girl, something. I don't know anything about point shaving, girls, anything, all right? Did you know Jeff King? I met him. Didn't like him. He ever tried to sign you? Didn't want him. King was a pig, you know. He wanted a piece of everything. Salaries, endorsements, merchandising. Did you and Mayron ever talk about him? We talked about basketball, period. Look, Elvin, I know it's got to be tough living in the shadow of a guy like Mayron Hughes. Some people think that without you feeding him the ball, he never would have become a star. I don't care what people think. I got to practice. What do you know about this guy, Desmond? King hated him. They wanted nothing to do with him. He went nuts when he found out Mayron signed on with Redbird. I told you, I got to practice. Even though I knew he was innocent, as soon as he hit the street, Mayron's rage drove him back to his old turf, where he struggled to find some justice. I want some answers. I want them now. What's wrong with you? Who killed my father? Man, why are you asking me? I had nothing to do with him. I liked Nori. Man, so who killed him? Man, you don't want to know. Now, I can't tell you, all right? If I tell you, you'll be next. Man, you let me worry about me. <laughs> And let the cops handle this man. Don't blow me off. And my father practically raised you. You owe him this. Why do you think I'm trying to keep you alive? You do what's right. And you do it now. Sign of Elvin? Nothing. Hammer. We gotta talk, man. What's going on? Look, man, Nori was a good man. Now, he always did right by me. But this has gotten way out of control. What do you mean? I mean, look, everybody's after me wants money. More people are gonna die if we don't do something. Yeah. I gotta show you something. Come with me. Look out! Oh. 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 